Okay, it's beer o'clock again on the Real Ale Guide. Today's beer is a beer from Nina Shams or Bulgari, and it is a bottle of the uh, My Singing Midwinter Brig. Mid Midwinter Brigged 2012. As I said, Nina Shams or Bulgari coming at 6% ABV. Don't know too much about this beer, but let's see if I pronounced it as well, I pronounce it as best as I possibly can, but let's see how close I got if you're watching in Sweden. Let's get this beer open. Here's the bottle cap. Nine of Shams. Really like this brewery. Looks a good dark beer for 6%. Whoa, plenty of smoke. Plenty of smoke. And. One of them beers you've got to catch, otherwise you'll all go down the sink. Okay, so without hes hesitating too much of a guess, there's plenty of carbonation in this one. Look at that raging as soon as you put some more beer in that glass. It is a one finger head, slightly off white. Nice amount of carbonation, it's black. Let's get a nose into this one. Loads of roasted malt. Kind of a smoked, it's got a smokiness to it, a smoky appeal. Mixed with maybe a bit of port or sherry or that kind of nose. A little vinous. Oh, I'm looking forward to this one. I'm going to dig in. Cheers. Oh, cherry, cherry fruit, and then kind of pow. Nice roastedness in the middle. And then back to that kind of hoppy back end to the beer. That's got a kind of a really forest fruit gatto kind of loveliness to it. It's really nice and sweet. Really nice mouth feel. There you go. The beer. Nice and steady, jet black in the glass. Hardly any light. There's a little bit of light coming through. Might be very difficult to get on the camera. Otherwise, it's a it's quite a nice, sweet kind of winter, almost kind of sweety kind of candied fruit taste to this one. Cinnamon, cinnamon, only a kind of touch. It's not big in your face, kind of wacky, big, spicy on rushes. It's not that kind of, but it definitely has that spiciness to it. It creeps up on the back end, but it's it it amounts to cinnamon, a hint of licorice. And all, all of them roasted kind of flavours you expect from a beer like this. Your coffee, your caramel, your chocolate. Nice amounts of carbonation. 
helps the beer kind of push around the inside of the mouth releases all them lovely flavours it's a bit of a actually thinking about it now the more I'm sipping at it it's not a big spicy bomb of a beer but the more I'm sipping away at this the more it's kind of ah this is this is nice this is quite uh, in between that kind of onrush of spice and just a hint of it let's swirl this beer around then release some more of these nice aromas that's almost vinous there in the nose mmm really good I want to give out the website and then a final thought and a rating from me. It's www.angrigeri.se. I'll put my finger on it and get it up to the camera. There you go. Apologies, I am still working upside down with my bit of a broken camera my final thoughts on a rating then for this really nice Christmas humbug of a beer it's fruity it's spicy cinnamony it's all subtle though it's all in balance it's all kind of working together it's not kind of pulling itself in different directions. It's a harmonious kind of willingness to go along with these different flavours, to match up, to, to, to go together with the chocolate, the coffee, the cinnamon, the spice, that kind of sweetness. It all goes together really well. So my 6% beer. I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. Um, Thank you to Johan for sending this beer to me. Put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe if you like. And cheers.